Oh, okay. You know, he's sort of of that. And I was planning to go. Cloth that they're cut from. <laughs> I and I was planning to watch that. Yeah. So that's good. Uh, but she filled the clinic, which is neat. She filled the clinic and has a waiting list. Whoa. Yeah. You know, last two people that called, she said, whoever gets to the check first. <laughs> you know, the other one's my waiting list, and if somebody cancels, you're the first one I call. So there we are. Uh, but it sounds kind of like the people who have seen him know him. Yes. <laughs> I think she does. Do you have any logs? I have a PVC pipe I can bring out. Oh, I don't think so. Because they roll, right? Oh. Yeah, that might not be good. You know, it, when you're searching to do that sort of thing, landscape logs. Uh huh. I actually I have a couple. Okay. They're they're a good because they don't roll easily. Yeah. Uh, they're a nice one to play with and they're not a mile long, so they're easy to move. Well he did uh Nick did recommend I get some logs for yeah, her. This would be a good thing for her to practice keeping that nice quiet frame and stepping underneath herself and stepping over things. Yes. Because again it helps to use a little bit different muscle. They learn to trust you to go over an obstacle. Uh, it also helps them practice putting their feet Yeah. That's pretty. Yes, this feels good. I like that. Does she feel any different since she's had her chiropractic work? She feels good. I'm not testing a whole lot yet. Yeah. <laughs> and he was talking about the the belly swing and he said her belly would swing more to the right than the left and he said when you ride her and if you feel her belly hanging up on one side he said help it over Ah. Okay, now that neck feels better. It looks better. Yeah, there's a more even bend. Now, this is all going to feel a little weird for her because it's been different. You know, yeah. <laughs> flies are bad, huh? They need a couple of really cold nights to kill them off. <laughs> it hasn't been cold enough, but they know it's coming, and I think they're just really hungry right now. Yeah. Oh, I tell you, riding that fox trotter was fun. I'll bet. Yeah. It's different, isn't it? Mm-hmm. It really is different. How is your fox trotter mare? I don't know this 
scores very well. And how many distractions do you think we could have in one block? No telling. As I'm thinking this, I notice that there are cones in the street. Cones in the street? Well, the cones in the street to divert the traffic around the backhoe that is digging up the asphalt and the dump truck that is arriving, backing up with its beeping and is about to dump its load of sand. Oh my lord. And here comes the jogger down the trail. My trail, right at us. And then there's the dog over here barking at me. And then my phone rings. <laughs> at this point, I'm just laughing. Like, I don't know this the Lord, I'm not answering that. Yeah. <laughs> Even on Dan, I wouldn't answer it because I wouldn't be able to hear you with, you know, the jackhammer. The jackhammer backhoe truck, truck backing up so jogger saying, yeah, phone ringing dog. I'm taking hand off the reins right now to pick up a phone in my pocket. I don't think so. And other than just, she was tense. I mean, it was a lot to take in. Yeah. But we just kept walking. And we walked past it all. Good. What a good horse. The phone call was Nick. That's why I'm laughing. He oh. Was, he was calling to find out how Doug's cat scan had come out. <laughs> but it just wasn't a good time to pick up. Yeah. <laughs> the cat scan okay? Yes. He's clean again. Six years in a row now. Yay. Yay. Right. Uh, continue our lives for 100 years. Oh, Kathy. Oh, that's brother, hard as an adult. Well, and they were huge. And his throat just gets so dry. He mouthwashes a lot of night, but it wakes him up. Yeah. Does he have that uh, moisturizing mouthwash? Yes. Okay. And that's good for about an hour and a half. To yeah. Two hours. Um, then he developed a case of thrush, which you know, oh, no. was still fun. So he took medication for that. And he did a sleep apnea study, but both kind of had mixed feelings on how effective that was. Uh, by the time he actually got into what we considered a REM sleep, uh -huh. they let him have it for about five minutes and woke him up. He sent him home. I was like, why did you actually let him stay in that and see what happens? Yeah. Yeah. So I'm not really impressed with that. I think they just want to get him on a machine because then they can you know, charge him. Right. Yeah, Bob has one. Yeah, so he's borrowed his dad's, one of the, his dad's extra ones, and he got the prescription, so he's got it calibrated to whatever it is he's supposed to be doing. And he's been testing it out. This is the third night he's tried it. He actually did get a four-hour walk last night, which is more than he had. Wow. But, yeah, he's, uh, he got to sleep. I mean, that's just so basic. You got to be able to sleep in the Yeah. That's hard. It is. I mean, he falls asleep in front of the computer at home. Oh, that Bob, uh, I hate to tell you where he's falling asleep. Driving? Yeah. When we were in Canada, I had to take over the wheel more than once. Yeah. Yeah, he just blinks and doesn't blink out of it. Uh, yeah, it's a little, it's a little scary. It, it's sort of amusing when you're playing video games with your son and you suddenly take your Blood Elf or whatever it is he's got on World of Warcraft and it goes off a cliff and Ronnie's like, Dad, where are you going? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Poor guy. But the reality of it is, yeah, you could be just go off the road into somebody. Yes. Uh, we are dealing with these issues right now. And of course then when he's up and out of bed and back in bed and out of bed and back in bed for a while. Well, Kathy, I'm going to admit I have my own room now. I believe it. Because he kicks oh. when he sleeps. He has that leg shaking syndrome oh, too. Oh gosh, that's so hard. And the machine, and yeah. it, he's on medication that makes him have a big startle reaction. Oh. And he can't hear. Okay. Add all that together. Okay. Yeah, oh yeah, you'll get karate kicked right out of bed. And I, that happened to me a few times. Yeah. He would wake up, because he took Kung Fu for years and did wrestling. Muscle memories. <laughs> and when he wakes up, he's in fight mode. Oh. And he's knocked me out of bed a few times. Yeah. He's kicked himself out of bed. <laughs> One of the funniest pictures I will have in my head forever.